How do you do? I know you think this will be a parody of Frankenstein because of this opening. And if you do, you sure are an idiot. Anyways, Mr. Moscow would be unwise to introduce this picture without a little word of warning. We are about to unfold in the story of Kevin Vihors, a man of evil who sought the kill to please his want for death and turmoil. Tis one of the strangest stories ever told. It deals with the two great mysteries of life, life and death. I think it will thrill you. It may shock you. It might horrify you. But it will kill you. It will. It will. Seriously, turn off the damn video. From his childhood, Kevin V. Horse was always an odd kid. One day he made masks, the next day he brutally butchered his entire family, and now lives locked away in a mental asylum. Or does he? Yes, he does. Kevin, you're about to be transferred to a security prison. How does that feel? Yeah, well, I bet you can't get my knife, can you? Can you? Oh my god, he's dead! Hey Bob, are you sure he's restrained enough? Those things look a bit loose. Uh, I sure hope so. Or else uh, we're gonna end like Swiss cheese. Wait a second. <laughs> Since then, nobody has ever heard from Kevin again. Until now. Say, this is gonna be some pretty good party, eh? I'm so excited! What if, what if, wait a minute. We might be late, and they've run out of candy. No. <laughs> they can't run out of candy, and this is gonna be great. I hope we don't meet a wise old guy who tells us about some kind of urban legend. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Onward to that mansion. Yeah. Say, kid, you heard about the story of Paperface? I'm not a kid, I'm 34. Well, anyway, there was a kid called Kevin here who lived 20 years ago. Are you sure that he wasn't 34? No, he is not 34. I'm sorry. Damn. And, uh, he killed all the people in this house here. And, oh like, my god, he was like crazy. Yeah, that's why I wondered why all you people are coming to party here. Oh, well. No one here, and uh, everyone likes parties, right? Yep. Yeah. Say, is that disco music? Yeah. Could have. Yeah, that's moving. Yeah, nice, nice homemade movie, isn't it? Hey, wait a minute! Look at that thing over there. What do you think it is? I don't know, but an old man mentioned something like that. Hmm. He you know, said something about. Stupid face. It's true. He said something about some kind of paper face. Yeah. That's a face. I mean, it's paper. Well, not really, but still, he must be right. Uh, Partially. Who knows? Uh, well, old we... Man. <gasps> we better go and talk to him about this. Oh, hello there, Sonny. Hey, do you know what this is? Oh, wait, well, hey, I told you people, this is the paper face mask, or at least one of them. He liked to make a lot of masks. So, only one of them, you mean there's more? 
Yeah, but he probably left with a mental asylum. I mean, he was treated there for like 20 years or 15 years. Well, that's a long time. Well, he's probably still here, lurking around this very campsite. Oh, the wolf no. is watching us. Ah, I'm scared.